I want y'all to be a witness. They're really with the shenanigans. Early on a Monday, someone's sending their application on page. Look at all these emails. Look at this. Who has time for this? Like, what are you talking about? Get a fax machine. Good afternoon, snappers. Good afternoon. Talk about not in the mood. I have not been in the mood for nothing. I didn't even want to snap you niggas. But I got excited because you guys, the weather we're having outside is so amazing. You know, I like to brag on blue skies. We finally have a nice day. So, I'm eating lunch in my car. And by eating lunch in my car, I'm eating bomb ass leftovers from my brother's house yesterday. It's going to be a great day. But I just wanted to grace y'all with my presence and this fucked up fro I got. Hey, y'all. When I pull up to my house and I don't get out, Jesse starts barking. Can y'all hear? I can hear all the way in my truck. I haven't even gotten out. Listen to them. Listen at all that noise. All that noise. Get in here, Jesse. And where's your cone? Little skinny bitch lost some weight. She does look really skinny. Come on, Jess. Jesse, get in here. Hi, babies. Hi, hi, hi. Y'all, I had an attitude all day, but getting home to these doggies and this beautiful weather. Look at that sky. We're about to go walk in the white neighborhood. Let's go for a walk. It's so nice and quiet and clean. Get it, Jesse. Get it, Jesse. Get it, Jesse. Oh, it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Y'all go get these snaps. I just love this neighborhood. See, when you walk in the white neighborhood, see that guy walking his dog? He just had the most pleasant conversation with me about my dogs. I need to move to a white neighborhood. I miss being around friendly white people. I had to hold Jesse back while Maggie and his dog were being friendly. And he was like, so Jesse doesn't like to be nice? I said, no. And he was like, Jesse needs to be more like Maggie. I said, who are you telling? Who are you telling? Y'all. And you know what? I probably talked myself into this bad day. So I just rode out with my dogs and had to run an errand, right? Why did I just blow my fucking tire? I hit a curb and my tire exploded. You don't believe me? Like, look how bad I hit this. I probably fucked up the frame. I can't, <laughs> y'all. Oh, I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna cry. I'm not even gonna cry. It's just another day in the fucking life. So let's go through the ramifications of our actions. I have my two dogs in here. I was just going up the street. I didn't bring their leashes. Um, I have to wait on roadside assistance. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm going to need a whole brand new fucking $250 tire. Let's find the money for that. <laughs> you know what, guys? I'm proud of myself because one, I did not cry. And I don't feel as bad as I usually do because remember, I just went home and had that random ass estate sale. So I do have money to cover this tire. It's not the end of the world. And I think, I think I have insurance on these tires. So you get a reduced rate when you have to buy a new one. And roadside assistance will be here soon. So while it is inconvenient, it is not the end of the world. I'm okay because a lot of y'all are messaging me like Ruth don't I'm okay it's not it's not that bad it, it'll be okay and how can you be sad when you have the best company in the world Maggie aren't we okay say we're okay we're okay save you yes I have six pits I love the baby I'm glad that you love them I love them I love them I just the same so I said it wasn't so bad waiting yes. I had good company the big grandma my big grandma just passed away April 13 years oh, I'm old. so sorry. I know how that is. And I have her son, her two daughters, and her grandma. Oh, wow. It's okay, mama. I got you. I got you. Yeah, I'm a big animal person. 
I can tell, but I love it because I'm an animal person just the same. I love all of them. Where's your license and registration? All right, Snapchatters. We are on our way. He was just like, oh, so you just, you just can't drive because he looked at another rim that was all scratched up. He goes, let me give you a word of advice. Take wider turns. I was like, I can do that. Well, let's drive on this donut, y'all, shall we? We're back home, we're back home, we're back home. And what's really fucked up is, I was supposed to do my hair today. But now that I've had this tiring ordeal, I don't wanna fucking sit here and twist this shit. <laughs> Y'all might see this fro tomorrow. It is a mess, but um, they'll be all right. Well, as I walk around my house and procrastinate, <laughs> I figured I'd show you guys something. You guys like when I share. You know, I just went home, look what I brought back. This. Da, 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 da. We need a light. Hold on. This, my good people, was my mommy's picture collage. If you ever came to my house, this was in our foyer, and it's the only little collage I ever know. And I'm so glad to have it in my house. I'll show you some pictures. That was my daddy. I think Cheese made him that um, little thing. There is my mama and daddy and Roman and Rachel. Rachel, my daddy, my mama. It's Rufy. Look how cute I was. It's Rufy. It's my mama. We still have that dress in her closet. That is Ruthie and my, that's my Aunt Hilda and I don't know that white lady, but that's actually my Aunt Hilda. It's my Auntie Jo and Rachel. That's Ruthie. It's Ruthie. Roman and Rachel. All three of us. Isn't it just so sweet? So yeah, I put this in my room because I want to see it every day. I love you guys.